So here's the question that comes up over and over and over, and we talked a little bit about it, this idea of balance. Is that a false notion for women? Because can we really, are we ever gonna have it all? I used to say, you can have it all, you just can't have it all at one time. Or is that a, is that a false notion? Look, I, I am always uh, irritated by the you can have it all statement. And I, I grew irritated with that phrase and that expectation the older I got, as you're trying to have it all. Yeah. And you're beating yourself up. Right. And feeling less than because you aren't having it all. Um, because it is, a, it's, it's, a, it's a ridiculous aspiration. Especially Look. if you're looking at everybody else's Facebook page. Oh, God, everybody has it all. Everybody's yeah. lying. They're lying. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all need to stop lying. <laughs> Be real about the fact that, you know, no one gets everything. That was one of the first rules you learned as a little kid. You don't always get your way. Come on, people. You don't always yeah. get what you want all the time. And that's true in life. So what I've told many young people is that you can have it all, but oftentimes it's hard to get it all at the same time. Yeah, I believe You that. know, so it's just a, manage, a, a matter of managing expectations. So for me, for example, you know, when your husband is president of the United States and you have children, something's got to give. You know, I, I've, I've made compromises in my life, in my career, but I've also in exchange gained a wonderful platform to do some great work. Who would have ever imagined that we would make the inroads we've made on healthy eating and changing the way our kids are fed in school? And, uh, you know, I, yeah, I can point to so many things that I've had, um, I've been able to do. Uh, if I want to be heavily involved in my girls' lives, that means that sometimes I have to put some things on the back burner to give them what they need. So it's, it's hard to have it all. Um, but that's where you go back to knowing who you are and knowing that, you know, you're really living through phases. And if, you don't, if you're compromising through one phase of your journey, you're not, not giving it all up. You're just, you're, you're compromising for that phase. There's another phase that's coming up where you might be able to have more of what you thought you wanted you know, you get to know yourself a little bit more. Um, so, so no, I, I, I don't want young women out there to have the expectation that if they're not having it all, that somehow they're failing. Life is hard, but life is long. If you maintain your health, which is one of the reasons why we talk about health, talk about taking care of yourself, because you want to get to the next phases in life where you can do more of what you want to do at any given time. You want to be wherever you are right now, and just like you say, I'm not through. Mm -hmm. No. You're not through. Not, not through. through. So 